Since the exciting discovery of pine martens in Shropshire in 2015, Shropshire Wildlife Trust's Pine Martin Project is aimed to monitor the pine martens and to raise awareness of them in the local community. In 2015, a pine martin was photographed running through our Clinton Compass Nature Reserve in broad daylight by a local photographer, Dave Pierce. This is the exact spot where Dave watched the pine martin run through. Dave was shocked to see the creature but acted quickly and was able to get a series of photographs which he quickly sent to Shropshire Wildlife Trust. Just a few days after Dave's sighting, our Pine Martin team quickly got out to the site and put some wildlife cameras in the woodland. This discovery offered the first opportunity in England to monitor an active Pine Martin population with modern technology. Pine martins are house cat sized animals related to stoats and weasels. They are recognisable by a long furry tail, chocolate brown coat, and a distinctive cream throat bib, being mostly active at dawn and dusk and very hard to spot. The reason that I set this camera trap up here is because we're, we've got it pointing straight into this undercut and that undercut is perfect for small mammals to be hiding out in. And there's generally a, a little trail right in front of the undercut. We've got the camera trap looking along that really subtle trail and there's only one way to find out if it actually works and that is to, to have a look at the camera trap now. Another way to select a site for where to put a camera trap has been to use a sniffer dog that has been specifically trained to sniff out Pine Martin scent. Luna is often used to detect Pine Martin scat, but she often detects scent where there is no physical evidence to be found by project staff. Anybody can help the Pine Martin project, but it could just be making a donation. The donations pay for extra trail cameras and they'll of course pay for extra dead boxes that we can put up for the Pine Martins and give them a helping hand in the area. It's also worth bearing in mind that if you're walking in the woods in this area, there's a very good chance that you might come across a creature that you've never encountered before.